your WhatsApp. No, I'm keeping it tranquilo, bro. You know, I mean, demand is crazy down south, man. Crazy. Yeah, well, you know, the feds are not supplying the arms to the Mexican criminals, so someone's got to step it. Oh, yeah, they need guns, bro. So many guns. Luckily for us, they're easily acquired up here. Yeah, well, that's our freedom's gift to the world, man. Right? You American? Man, I didn't even know. Anyway, shit, it's going to be profitable for the both of us. But completion is tough, bro. To control the market down there, uh, we gotta control supply up here. We got a couple local contracts to help us out stateside, so this plane is loaded with their shipments. You make a couple drops, you come back here. You know, they say that the American industry is suffering, but uh, you and I, <laughs> we got a good export store. Ah, okay. Ah, I'll be on the radio, man. That's great. Successful draw. Good work. Some lovely ladies just south of the border. Ah, okay. How long you been up here anyway? You seem to know your way around. Well, maybe five years on and off. I pretty much stay more now. Too much competition. I have to stay visible. And you? I mean, even I know that ain't a San Andrean accent. Sandy Shores, few years. Self-destructive right-wing misfits, mad guns, incest. Closest I could find to the Midwest.
Come on! So, I'm sitting in a go-kart with nowhere to go. That's an all-terrain vehicle fitted with GPS tracking system, CB radio... That'd be the radio we're talking on, then. We use these to pick up the shipments. There's a plane making a drop soon near a mobile home off East Joshua Road. Make it fast. Those rednecks have been sniffing around. I think you'll find rural American is the politically correct term. And I think the cops got eyes on us, so try to avoid the main roads. Is there anyone who doesn't know about this? Be blessed to know I have the package. <laughs> 